what's up everybody welcome back to the channel today we got a little mail and we got some more series one but here's the thing i tried to pick out the like exclusive stuff and the stuff i know everybody is opening series one right now so i tried to get like offhand just offhand stuff so anyway we got uh the meyer exclusive you get one uh, 16 card pack and you get two exclusive purple parallels. I uh, took a quick look at eBay before this video and purples are selling for pretty good money if you get a good rookie out of them. So, excited to check those out. And, we got some mail from Tops. It's a redemption. Very excited. Uh, don't want to spoil it, but I think it'll go good in the background. We got the Topps Rainbow Foil, Luis Robert Rookie. We got the Refractor Robert Rookie out of Chrome. We got the Prism Refractor out of Chrome. And we got the X-Fractor out of a Chrome. So let's open this up. I've been waiting patiently. I got this earlier today in the mail. And, of course, I wanted to open it immediately. But then I was like, you know what? It's a pretty cool card. It shouldn't be a pretty good uh, reveal video. So, I'll go ahead and open it for you guys to check out with me. I'll try and be careful with it just because I don't know how they package their redemptions. Anyway, here we go. So, one. Oh, okay. Never mind. I was retarded. Could have just probably I had tape on it. Either way, here we go. So here it is. It will go very nicely in the back with the other. Let's get it out of here, maybe. I'm trying to slow reveal it, but it's not working out very well. Anyway, here we go. And boom! Finally, after four months, I think, maybe a little bit longer. Got my Luis Robert rookie autograph. Uh, nothing on there you need to see. Uh, not the refractor or anything. It's just the base, so it's not numbered, but still. Um, should be in very good condition. Like most of these I've seen, they usually send... I don't know how many of these he signed, but I'm sure they sent him like a 500,000, or not 500, 500 or 1,000 count box, like filled with these cards, and he just sat there and autographed them all. So yeah, this probably was in his hands at one moment. Kind of cool, right? Uh, I won't take the time to put it in the one touch right now, but I just wanted to you know, leave the empty one touch for some suspense. So yeah, I think it looks pretty good back there with his brothers. All right, let's get into these. So yeah, they are three forty nine, and they're only at Meyer. So if you don't have a Meyer around you, unfortunately, it's the only place you can get these. Here are the odds. They're about what you would expect for a little bit. Actually, they're about the same as everything else. <laughs> I don't know what I was going to say there, but yeah. The purples are on the back of this pack here, not inside the pack. So you get the 16 cards plus the two purples. So, a little math there, you get 18 cards for 350. And these look, I think they look awesome this year. I like the purple border. I think they look really good. And our second one out of this pack is Patrick Sandoval. So yeah, we got Oscar Mercado, Mercado, and Patrick Sandoval. The backs, they don't say anything that we would know that they're different, but obviously they're purple. Not numbered. That's what I was getting at. Yeah, the rookies out of those are getting pretty good money. I won't lie, I opened one, or opened two before the video. I actually got a mem card of... Uh, I can't remember who it was. And I got a Nate Pearson purple. And that was, I looked, I think those were sold for like 20 bucks. So yeah, that was the first pack. I got $20 worth of value. Pretty good. 
Plus the MIM card, I had probably five bucks maybe. Not bad. Colton Wong. Uh, we'll get through these pretty quick. Probably seen a lot of Series 1 by now. Ooh, nice. So we got a Boba Shet. Uh, Chrome. Uh, Reduce. Whatever year these were. 52, I think. Not numbered, but pretty awesome. You get a Boba Shet one. There's 50 cards in that checklist, so. It could have been Raphael Devers. And then we got a rookie, Edward Olivares. We'll just put the rookies and inserts in that pile there. Garcia. Mondesi. Justin Verlander. Yeah, not a bad first pack. Got the refractor. Or it's not a refractor. I think these are all refractors. So it goes chrome and then it goes like the colored parallels. And then, of course, I think they got a Super Fractor, like one of one. Probably won't see one of those, but you never know. All right, next pack are purples. You like to see rookies out of these, but I don't think we're going to get one here, obviously. Max Stessy and Hunter Harvey. Purples. If you get them in good condition, that's also a rare thing. Because, like I said, they're just flopping around in the back of the pack. So a lot of times you'll get banged up corners. These are the worst. Yeah, there's a little white there. But, yeah. They can be a lot worse than that. Definitely, I've seen, seen that. They usually have these for every, uh, every series that comes out. Uh, series 1, 2, and update. They had the update ones, I think, last week. They even had them there. But nobody liked to update, so... I don't think I bought any of the update ones. Marcus Simeon. Leo de Tavares, rookie. Mike Miner. And another Chrome, Joey Votto. I guess you got pretty good odds of getting chromes out of these. Justin Verlander. Or Fade 2 Red. Red. Reddick. Gretarol. Jimenez. Andres. And Nick Madrigal. Not bad. Be nice to get a purple of him. Alright, it's three left. This won't be a very long video. Didn't really have anything else new today at the store. They had a ton, of course, of Series 1. A bunch of blasters and everything, but... Like I said, I'll probably be opening those for a while. Off camera and maybe on camera every once in a while. So I'm not going to overload the channel with Series 1. Because besides the parallels, it's not really too exciting. And the parallels are very hard to come by. Except for like the chrome of those. Obviously. <laughs> Alright. Kenta Maeda. Omar. Orlando. Is that Evan White? Rookie. That's a good one. Uh, Austin Meadows. Eduardo Escobar, Mookie Betts, World Series, uh, Seth Lugo, nice, okay, so we we'll open three, we got three chromes, we got a Luis Robert, chrome, I'm definitely going to sleeve that one up right now, uh, I'm sure the value on these will probably drop by right now just because this just came out on Wednesday, I think these were going for like 40 45 bucks and like i said though once it's been out for a little while and it's looking like they uh, printed a good amount so i'm sure it won't be too hard to find like nobody i was with today or at the mire when they were stocking or whatever i mean people were fighting over series one so 
Brian Mountcastle. I think this is the first one of him I've got. I love Korea. I was looking through them earlier out of the mega box and blaster I opened and so you know what? I don't think I got a Mount Castle. So there he is. Oh we got him. Another good one to get a purple of, but like I said, nothing is guaranteed. There's 320 cards and it could be any one of those 320 cards. So here we go. Next ones. We got uh, Jerks and Profar. And we got a rookie. Who is it? Brady Singer. We got a Brady Singer purple. Looks pretty good too. Bottom corner here. Not the greatest, but hey. Like I said, they're kind of hard to get uh, perfect because they're just sliding around and in the back of there. But we'll sleeve him up since it's a rookie. Where's the pack? Here it is. Alright. Let's see what we get here. And we got Brandon Nimmo. Rear. Charlie Morton. Matt Chapman. Soria. Wade Davis. Travis. You Darvish. Brian Yarbrough. We got a Freddie Freeman. 52. I think they're 52. I hope they are because I'm calling that. Calling them that like the whole video. Gio Gonzalez. Wilson Contreras. Mitch Moreland. Michael Trout. Shane Bieber. We didn't get one rookie in that pack. Let me look on the back here just to make sure I'm not making stuff. Uh, this is Dang it. Can't find it. Either way, I'm taking up a lot of time here. Sorry about that. Alright, last one. Let's hope for a good rookie. We got one rookie out of the last one, but wasn't who we were looking for. And our last purples are going to be a playful bout of juniors. So we got the Vladdy Acuna will play fighting card and it's not Tatis it's Chris Paddock so we got Chris Paddock purple and the play fight purple none of the big rookies this round but like I said I'll pick some more of these up if I see them again because they're they're decent price I mean if you buy 20 bucks worth you almost get a blaster and you get the purples, you get all packs instead of one stupid, uh, <laughs> what are they called? The uh, patch cards or whatever. If you didn't watch my review or video of the Mega and Blaster, go watch that. If you haven't seen what comes in the Blasters, because I think they are pretty crappy. No reason to pay more to get a Blaster with that in it. We got Dane Dunning, rookie. Got a Christian Javier. Uh, can't remember what these are. 86. Nolan Arenado. I guess we'll throw that up there. Uh, Nick Heath. Rookie. Tristan McKenzie. Rookie. Shohei Otani. Shane Bieber. And Mike Fulte. 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 So there we go. Uh, nothing too crazy. Yeah, we got the pile of rookies here. Yeah, and the PD2s. Decent rookies. Our purples, we didn't do the greatest with the purples, but I already told you why that's a possibility. That'll happen to you. They're all in pretty good shape though. I was pleasantly surprised with the shape. Uh, corners and obviously the centering is pretty good on all of these. 
Uh, we did get some of the chromes out of these packs. Uh, the ones I didn't sleeve up. We got Joey Votto and Bo Bichette. You know what? We're going to be nice to Bo. Be nice to Bo. Put him in the highlight pile. Speaking of which. <laughs> so yeah. Our little highlight pile out of this opening. Of the five Meyer purple packs. We got a Robert Chrome. Boba Shet Chrome. We got the Brady Singer purple. It's the only rookie, unfortunately, we got out of this round. Uh, Ryan Mountcastle rookie. And... Nick Madrigal. So yeah, a little bit of, a little bit of series one, but the main, most exciting thing of the video is I got my Robert autograph. Get that out of here and put it in one touch and put that on display with the other ones in my case. And we're gonna lay it there for now, cause yeah. So yeah, let me know what you think. Are you? I'm, Pretty sure most of you hopefully have opened the series one by now. How do you like it? Uh, I read a comment that they said the names were a little small. They are. If you're like doing videos. I mean, if this was me off video. Just looking at the cards like I would normally. The names don't bother me. But I can see like on video. Kind of hard to read. Unless you get them like right there. But yeah. Whatever. I do like the border and everything and the way the cards look. Uh, other than the smaller names, I didn't really see any other complaints. So, yeah. Just give Tops a thumbs up on Series 1. And, uh, like I said, we'll probably be opening a little bit more on the channel. I got those blasters coming in, hanger boxes, and the tins. Kind of excited for the tins. I had pretty good luck with the tins last year, so... Hopefully that luck streak continues with this year's 10th. But yeah, stay tuned for that. Subscribe so you will see when those videos are posted. I mean, to do even more, you hit the little bell and you'll get a notification. It's kind of annoying though, especially if you have a bell on like everybody, because everybody posts videos at least once or twice a week, so you're going to be getting a lot of notifications. I don't know, hate you if you don't hit the bell. <laughs> I understand. But yeah, uh, other than that... Hit the little thumbs up button and stay tuned for more fantastic videos. Peace.